Hey everyone, it's Ivan, capadger.com, out here to tell you about a new case for a new gun. If you followed my content, you may have seen my review of the double rifle case by Impact Casing Container. Local company, do an amazing job making all kinds of aluminum cases to include gun cases. And this one has served me very well taking it all over the place and being a double rifle case, have a couple rifles in here, but I needed a new case for a new gun. So I ended up going and talking to the guys over there. Since these guys are actually local to me, I was able to go visit them. They're in Hayden, Idaho. Really cool operation. As I mentioned, they make gun cases, but they make a lot of things. Really cool to kind of step behind the scenes, see how the, some of the stuff's made, to include like these giant CNC machines where they will machine out these fixtures for massive cases, like by way of example. Basically these giant cases where they will put all the turbine blades for like Boeing engines in them. Like giant jet engines, all the turbine blades, basically these huge fixtures so they can ship all the blades to where, I don't know, they need to do maintenance, whatever it may be. Crazy huge cases, pretty neat. All kinds of stock coming in there, whether it's just big slabs of aluminum or different kind of preformed like bar stock, things along those lines. And yeah, get in to check it out. So as I mentioned, needed a new gun case. This right here, my double gun case, wheels, all of that, I will say. These are actually the older style of wheels. They have new style of wheels now, but a bunch of great features. I've used it a ton. It's gotten pretty beat up, still keeps going, and I needed a new one, and this one would not work. Why? Well, really fortunate, had the opportunity to go build a, basically build a muzzle loading rifle, Flintlock, with Jim Chambers Customs. Start with a kit, takes about a week, end up building it. Really excited. But 44 inch barrel. Overall length is like 60 inches. Bigger than this case. So I was like, I need to figure out a new case. And it's one of those where I'm gonna invest a lot of time and a lot of money in building that gun. I don't wanna throw it in like a plastic Plano case and see how long until that thing comes shredded and destroys my hopefully amazing rifle that I'm gonna be building. So I wanted something really strong and durable. I have flown a lot with this guy and well, that's the testament right there. Most recently ended up actually going on a hunting trip to Texas with my son. We had my SR25 and Radian Model 1 in here. Did a great job, and despite, I'm sure, the baggage handlers doing their best to destroy this thing, keeps on going. But I needed more room, so I ended up going and getting this case. Really cool, nice, big, I wanna say over 61 inches as far as internal volume, and honestly, it was really cool to watch the work kinda of go into this. Basically getting to see this whole thing assembled and come to life right then and there.
There's a lot of really great features I like with these cases to include the way it locks with a locking bar. So you have one main lock rather than having to have, you could if you want, four individual locks and your handle so you can run this thing through the airport. And then over here on the hinge side, basically one huge giant hinge. So it actually opens and closes correctly. If you've ever used some cases where they have just one or two hinges like along the entire length of the case, never wants to close right, always fighting it, not with this. And it was really cool seeing this thing come together and yeah, get ready to take this thing over after I build out my flint lock and safely bring it back. This, I want to say, is their longest rifle case. It's actually made for muzzleloader rifles because they tend to have longer barrels, but they make all kinds of different cases, and they're even offered in different color powder coat, which is pretty cool. This one, being their green, they also have kind of a flat dark earth as well as a black. Ivan, won't the luggage handlers scratch that powder coat? I'm sure they will. I don't care. Big picture, it'll probably get a little dinged up, but it's gonna protect my investment. And that's where good quality gun cases come in. It's like buying like a $2,500 pistol and then going and getting to Uncle Mike's holster off of Amazon. You can, or you could like maybe protect that investment a little bit more. And to that end, being able to go spend the time, make a really cool, essentially custom flintlock rifle myself, which I'm really excited about. And yeah, I don't want that thing beat up. So being able to throw it in this case and call it good. But if you're looking for gun cases or maybe a case for some turbine jet engine propellers, I don't know. They make all kinds of stuff to include custom stuff if you're looking for something really specific. But you can check them out over at Impact Case and Container. And as always, thanks for joining us at kitbadger.com. Look forward to seeing you next time. Guess up, man. What's this for?